sun's rising behind you. It's coming up fast. Hey, shield's down. Losing one. He's got escape velocity a thousand feet and climbing. Ah! Mark my tail. Get the head out of there. about gassing. Monash is injured. They have to go get gas. There's no time for that. Repressurize the cargo bay. He's going to die out there. We can still find him. He has a beacon. I, I don't have time to argue with you. Just sit down. Be quiet. I'm on the fucking locator. Use most of our propellant to get us out of the coma. We can't just leave him. We have to go back. If we go back for Gus, we all die. We can't just leave him in space. lifted off the comet, but sadly, Gus Partenza has been lost. Gus Partenza, a native of Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, and graduate of Carnegie Mellon University, joined the NASA space program shortly after completing his medical training at Duke University. Dr. Partenza was selected specifically for this mission, not only for his medical expertise, but also for his dedication to the advancement of space technology. Dr. Gus Partenza and with Oren Monash injured, Captain Spurgeon Tanner is now in charge of the mission. The Messiah has successfully docked with the Orion powered boosters and is now prepared to detonate the bomb's planet on Wolf Biederman. The Messiah's exterior mounted camera will show us the detonation, but not before being temporarily blocked out by the nuclear blast.